അസലാം വാലൈക്കും വറഹമത്തുള്ളി വബർക്കാത്തു ഈയൊരു വിഷയ കാർട്ടൂൺ സ്റ്റോറി ദ ഫോർ ബേഡ്സ് ഡു യു നോ വാട്ട് ആപ്പൺ ടു അവർ ഫെലോ ബേഡ് എസ്റ്റഡേ നോ വാട്ട് ആപ്പൺ ടു ദം ഇൻഡീഡ് അള്ളാ ഹാസ് ബിസ്റ്റോഡ് എ ഗ്രേറ്റ് മിറാക്കൽ അപ്പോൺ പ്രോഫിറ്റ് ഇബ്രാഹിം അലൈഹി സ്വലാം പ്രോഫിറ്റ് ഇബ്രാഹിം അലൈഹി സ്വലാം ബിസീസ് അള്ളാ ടു ഡെമോൺസ്ട്രേറ്റ് ഫോർ ഹിം ഹൗ ഹി ബ്രിങ് ദ ഡെഡ് ബാക്ക് ടു ലൈഫ് Why did the Prophet Ibrahim a.s. seek from Allah such a strange thing? Because he was eager to witness for himself this divine power directly. What did Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala say to him? Allah ordered him to select four different birds. and to examine them carefully in order that he become familiar with their features then allah ordered him to slaughter them and to cut them into several small pieces then he ordered him to place those pieces on the peaks of the surrounding mountain what happened next allah the glorified ordered him to call out the bird the parts of which were on the mountain peak so what happened when the prophet did that the parts of the bird came towards him and joined themselves together in front of him and allah brought them to life again glorified be allah yes indeed allah has power over all things and remember when ibrahim alayhi salam said my lord show me how you give life to the dead he allah said do you not believe he that is ibrahim said yes i believe but to be stronger in faith He, that is Allah said, take four birds, then cause them to incline towards you, then slaughter them, cut them into pieces, and then put a portion of them on every hill and call them. They will come to you in haste, and know that Allah is Almighty, all wise. From the Holy Quran, chapter 2, verse number 260. as per tafsir ibn kathir hope you have enjoyed the story pray for us jazakallah khair assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh